These are soap bubbles. Aren't they beautiful? Have you wondered from where do the bubbles get their color? To know it, first we need to know what is color. We see colors all around us. They are mostly either paint or dye. But whatever may be the reason, we see red, green and blue and all sorts of color all around us. But why red is red and green is green? To know it, first we need to know what is light. White light is combination of all different colors. Now, when white light falls onto an object, uh, object could be anything. For instance, we take it to be a mobile, pure mobile cover, which appears to be blue. It absorbs all the colors except blue. That's why it appears to be blue. Now, there is another part of your story. When light enters into your eye through the cornea and it focuses onto the retina, it gives you the sensation of the color. What about bubbles? They don't have any pigments, but from where do they get their colors? Let's take a pause and let us know what exactly bubble is made up of. So if we make a section of the bubble, it consists of three different layers. Two layers of surfactant molecules, inner and outer layers, and in between there is a thin water film. Now, when light falls onto the front surface of the soap bubble, it gets reflected and also same thing happens from the back surface as well. Now, based on the thickness of the film, some of the color is being removed from white light. So as a result, the colors appear to us is the light in full spectrum, visible spectrum, minus the light that has been lost based on the thickness of the film. Now, due to many reasons like gravitation, surface tension, or thickness tend to change. As a result, we see moving colors all around the surface of the bubble film. This is a picture exactly taken while the bubble is getting burst and you can see flying water droplets. So, now you know it, from where the bubbles get their colors. See you next time. Until then, enjoy the beauty of bubbles.